In this video, we'll discuss the difference between using NTFS, XFAT, or HFS Plus for macOS. To check how a drive is formatted, we'll take a look in Disk Utility. On the desktop, click Go at the top, then Utilities. Now double-click Disk Utility in the list. From the list of drives on the left, select the Backup Plus volume. Under its name, in the main window of Disk Utility, we can see which file system it's using. HFS Plus is the default file system for macOS. If your drive will only be used on Mac systems, then you're ready to go and don't need to install the Paragon driver. NTFS is the default file system for Windows. macOS lets you read a drive with an NTFS file system, but can't write to it without some help. Paragon can be installed to do just that. If your drive will be used on both Mac and Windows, formatting it to NTFS and using Paragon on Mac OS is one option. Another option is to use the XFAT file system. Both Windows and Mac OS have full access to this file system without the need for any extra software. See the description below for a link to a knowledge base article on how to format a drive in Mac OS. If using NTFS, the rest of this video walks through the Paragon driver installation process. In the previous video, we showed how to download the Paragon driver while setting up a Backup Plus drive. It can also be found on our support site. The easiest way to get there is simply to Google it. Click on Paragon driver for Mac OS 10.10 and above. Then click the download button. Once installed, this software requires a restart so it's best to go ahead and save any open documents and close them. Click on Install Paragon NTFS for Mac in the installation window. After reading the software license agreement, select I accept and click Next. Confirm with your Mac user's administrator password and click Install Helper. A message pops up that the system extension is blocked. We need to enable this extension, so click on Open Security Preferences. Then in the General tab, see where System Software from Developer Paragon Software was blocked from loading. Click the Allow button. Go back to the Paragon installer window and let it finish. It might seem stuck, just give it some time to finish up. Once finished, the installer displays some information on exactly what Paragon does. Click the Next button to see advanced information. When ready, click the Restart button to restart the Mac. Paragon needs a system restart to work properly. Now, NTFS Drive can be used on this system with full access and on Windows systems natively. Check out our other videos for more information on how to use Toolkit on Mac OS. The description below also has some handy links that might be useful to you. Thank you for your time and for being a Seagate customer.